Time for your lunch break. Produce man Michael Marks is here with the lowdown on pomegranates. Yeah, let's talk pomegranates. First, let's talk about the word pomegranate. Word pomegranate, palm means apple. Granite means many seeds. So it's an apple with many seeds. We get a few other words from uh, the root words there. Uh, grenade comes from that, right? It breaks open into many, many pieces. Uh, the islands of Grenada, right? Uh, it looks like a bunch of seeds scattered in the ocean. So we get many words from it. This is a pomegranate right here. Check this out. Uh, a lot of people love pomegranates. A lot of people are intimidated by pomegranates. Now they came to the United States actually in the 1700s. Uh, the Spanish uh, missionaries who came here, Francis Franciscan missionaries brought them here. They originated in the Middle East in what we call Iran today. So they love hot, dry, conditions. And so they love the hot, dry conditions of the San Joaquin Valley. In fact, they have a saying that the hotter the temperatures in summer, the sweeter the pomegranate in winter. So let's, uh, I'm going to cut this open. Um, this is the shoulder, right around here is the shoulder. I'm just going to barely cut into the shoulder. I'm not going to cut too deep. Uh, you need to have a, a really bright shirt on like I do. So if you get polka dots on it, uh, you'll never know that you got polka dots on it. Now I'm going to pull this cap off right around the blossom end to expose the seeds on the inside. Take a look at that. Just absolutely gorgeous in there. Look at that. Now, if you notice, uh, there is a, a cell here, a cell here. There's no, normal cells. So I'm going to, what I'm going to do, I'm going to cut right down here. I'm not going to cut all the way through. I'm going to right down here. going to cut it open the middle and we're going to tear that Tear that out. Look at those seeds. Oh my goodness. Loaded with polyphenols, loaded with antioxidants. These are probably one of the nature's uh, stars when it comes. Look at my hands already. It, it, yeah, this is what happens. So how do you get all the seeds out without making a mess all over the kitchen? Okay, here's what I do. I take these little cells and I will put them in some water, a big bucket of water, and then I will separate those seeds. They're actually not seeds. The seeds are in the arrows there. These are actually called arrows. That's right. And the seeds are inside. And you separate those, the seeds will sink to the bottom, and all that white pithy stuff comes to the top. And now you have your seeds. A lot of people love them. They, they will freeze them and bring them out all winter long. Hey, back to you guys.